He left wife, four children. They don't deserve to be without their dad. <laughs> four kids were supposed to be celebrating Father's Day with their dad on Sunday. These kids, you know, they're, they will never see their father again. But instead, they're helping to wash cars to pay for his funeral. Hard work! We were gonna go camping this weekend. We already had booked our camping spot. He said, don't forget to get your life jacket. His three sisters say 31-year-old Pedro Gill was one of two innocent bystanders killed as a stolen car slammed into a carport at Taco Vallalta near 14th and D Street after leading police on a short chase the day before Father's Day. My face hurts from crying. I just want my brother back and he's never going to come back. He's never going to call us to tell us to come to his house to have dinner. Bring, everybody bring food, bring chips, just come, just come. He was the provider, you know, and we feel for, for his wife, his kids, you know, it's going to, life is going to suck without me, my brother. Graciela Ariano, one of his three sisters, says the car wash is meant to serve as another tool for grieving because she, like so many others here, can't stand to be alone right now. I'm trying not to go home because when I go home, it hits me, you know? And so we're none of us right now, home. we need to stay together because the worst is to come. It's a loss that cuts deep leaving four kids ages 8 to 11 without their father and leaving one mother without her only son. He's my only boy. <laughs> breaking my heart and I'm not going to see him anymore. Dozens of candles, flowers, and Father's Day balloons now lay next to the intersection that took his life. He's just a really outgoing, happy person. <laughs> <laughs> as his family struggles to make sense of this sudden loss. We're gonna miss him. <laughs>